Hello viewers, welcome to LinuxHelp.com. Today we're gonna see how to install Moodle on CentOS 7. Moodle is an open source learning management system and it has become one of the most popular learning management system among educators around the world. As a tool for creating a single robust, secure and integrated system that can help you create personalized learning environment on online courses as a dynamic website. So in this tutorial we'll see the installation part of Moodle on CentOS 7. So first we need to install EPL repo and you can do that by using the following command and then we are gonna add webtatic to install php 7.0 so let's first add the repository and then we, we have to install php7 and need a dependency by using the following command now the php has been installed and you can verify the php version by using a following command if you see here, PHP 7.0 has been installed. Next, we're gonna use Apache Web Server here. So let's install Apache. So it says the Apache latest version is already updated. And then let's enable and start the Apache service. And then we're gonna set the correct document root. So we're gonna open the Apache configuration file by using a following command below. Here we're gonna search the document root and add Moodle here. And then save and quit the file. After that, we're gonna install and configure MariaDB service now. And then now let's start and enable the MariaDB service. Next, we are going to configure the MariaDB. In order to get the MariaDB to compatible with Moodle, you need to enable INODB engine. And you can do that by editing the following file so in this file just paste the following lines and then save and quit and then we have to start restart the MariaDB next we are going to create a database and user for model so log in with your MariaDB as a root user Here I am creating a database model and also creating a user with a password. So it's done now. Finally, we have to download and install model. So we are downloading the latest version using the delegate command from the terminal. Now it is downloaded and then let's execute the following command to extract the files to the correct path. And then now we are going to assign the ownership. So here I am going to set Apache as the owner of the whole document root. So that's it. Now we have to restart the Apache web server. So it is done now and you can continue the further installation from the web browser. 
Now after opening the browser, navigate to the URL. Enter your host name or else your IP address. So this is the installation interface of the Moodle. So choose your language and then just press next. So just verify this path and confirm and then press next. Here you have to choose your database driver. And then here you have to enter your DB details. So enter the database username and then password. So if you have a database port on unit shock, just enter and click next. And then on the next interface, you just have to accept and press continue. Here if all the PHP modules were enabled, you will see that your server environment meets all the minimum requirements and then press continue. On the next page, the installation system will appear and it takes several minutes to complete. So once the installation system is complete, you will see the continue option. Just click on it. So here in the screen, you have to configure your main administrator account. So if you want to make any changes, you can change here. After that, click on update profile. So on the next page, you have to configure the front page settings. Here you can give your full site name. For example, here I am going to assign linuxhelptest.com. And then the short name will be Linux help. So if you want to give a page summary, you can assign here. And then after giving a location settings and authentication, you can click on save changes. So this is the dashboard of the Moodle and here you can manage your LMS. So this is how you install Moodle on Center i7. I hope this tutorial helps you. Thank you for watching. If you like it, please subscribe to our channel and also to watch more tutorials visit www.linuxhelp.com. Mail us to support.linuxhelp.com for any queries.